Hello guys, welcome back to another video. So in the last video, we saw that we have got a new firmware upgrade on DJI Mini 2, that is version 1.04. So with that particular firmware, we were not able to do the 15 meters hack with the help of drone hacks as well as the rainbow application. So in this video, we will be trying to uh, hack our drone uh, to fly more than 15 meters with the help of drone hacks. If that wasn't possible, then we will try to roll back our firmware from 1.04 to the 1.03. So without wasting much of time, let's quickly get into the video guys. Initially, we will download the latest version of the drone hack software in our laptop and try to do the 15 meter hack process. So to download the drone hack software, we need to visit the dronehack.com website. I'll be mentioning the link in the description. Once you download, you get the interface like this. So once this interface appears on your screen, you need to connect your drone to your laptop. So once your drone is connected, you'll be able to see the current firmware version of your drone that is 1.04 and the recommended firmware by the drone hacks is 1.03. So guys, if you come to the hacking uh, tab, there you will be able to see that no exploit for this particular firmware or the device. So basically for this firmware, we will not be able to do the hack process. So guys, wait, we have uh, another solution from the drone hacks. We get a feature of rolling back our firmware. We can flash the firmware to the required firmware version with the help of drone hacks. Once we click on flash original firmware, we see this kind of interface. We need to click on download firmware. So guys, as soon as we click on download firmware, we will be redirected to the dank drone downloader website. Here we need to select our drone version as well as the firmware that is required. So you can see for the mini 2, we need to click on 1.03 and we need to select aircraft and that is Mavic Mini 2 that is WM161 so once you select this you can click on the submit button once you hit on the submit button you will be able to see the two servers where you can download the old firmware so let's select any one of them and you can see that the firmware starts downloading to your machine So guys, once the downloading is done, you need to go back into the drone hacks software and you need to click on the choose firmware and go to the downloads and open this particular firmware. So once you open this firmware, you will be able to see the logs in the upper corner. So here we are getting the logs as uh, the current firmware that we have chose is 1.03 and the anti-roll value is 1. But we are also getting a log that is saying that anti-roll value of the drone is lower and we will not be able to uh, downroll or uh, anti-roll our firmware to the older version. So this means guys with the drone hacks we will not be able to downgrade our firmware. And I also checked the advanced parameters uh, for the anti-roll value but I did not find it in the advanced parameters. So. Uh, with the drone hacks it is not possible to roll back from 1.04 to 1.03 wait we have another solution to downgrade our drone with the help of dji assistant 2 so i'll be mentioning this uh, url of dji assistant 2 in the description you can check out this website as well so guys for dji assistant 2 we have various versions where it will support various different drones so from here we need to find out the dji assistant software which supports DJI Mini 2. So now we have to navigate to DJI Assistant 2 Customer Drone Series. So here when we scroll down we will be able to see that DJI Mini 2 is supported in this particular version and even DJI Mini SC. So we will be downloading the Windows version as we are using the Windows machine. So guys once the downloading is done you need to install this software and once the installation is done you need to open this particular software. For the installation process, it will hardly take around 5 to 10 minutes to install it on your PC. So once it's done, you can open this uh, particular software. Initially, you need to agree for the terms and conditions and also turn on the DJI account information. Once you turn on, you can click on the next. So here on this page, you can click on do it later and you get this kind of interface now you need to connect your drone to your laptop 
so i have connected my drone to the laptop and this is the interface that we get as soon as we connect we see the pop up that is dji mini 2 has been connected so here we are able to see that only log export is available but we are not able to see any firmware upgrade or anything like that so now we need to go to the installation path where we have installed this particular software i have installed it in d drive so once you open the program files you can uh, navigate to the dj assistant 2 then you need to click on dj engine in dj engine folder you will find a file named default settings you need to right click on that particular file and go to the properties once you click on properties you need to click on securities click on edit and check box full control modify everything and click on apply and click on okay so guys once you are done with this you guys can open this file in notepad or notepad plus plus and here you will be able to find that upgrade enable is equal to zero you need to make it one and upgrade enable should also be made one so once it's done you can save this file then close the dji assistant software and reopen it so guys once you open the dji assistant 2 software you need to connect your drone with your laptop Once the connection is done, you will be able to see on the screen that DJI Mini 2 has been connected Then you can open that and wait for a few seconds like around 2 to 3 seconds and later on uh, you will be able to see that firmware upgrade appears on the screen. So usually in this firmware upgrade we will be able to downgrade our DJI Mini 2 or mini any any drone we will be able to downgrade our firmwares with the help of dji assistant but guys here as you can see on the screen we are not getting an option of downgrade uh, so the only current version is visible over here that is version 1.04 so we are not getting any other versions where we can downgrade our drone so guys with a lot of tries with dji assistant 2 as well as drone hacks we were not able to downgrade our firmware so when I contacted DJI support team, they also said that uh, downgrade is not possible with the version 1.04. So now we have the only solution is we should wait for the update from the drone hacks. Uh, let's see if they can bypass this particular firmware. So till then I suggest you guys not to upgrade your firmware. So that's it for this video guys. I hope you have liked this video and found this video informative. If you guys found this video informative, do it a like button and subscribe to the channel. We'll meet in the next video. Till then take care. Bye bye.